Hi there, this is Mo Volans for Mac Pro Video, and we're going to be taking a look at mixing and mastering in Reason. And this is really for those of you who already are, are, are familiar with Reason and its feature set and use it regularly, but want to take your mixes and your masters to the next level. So regardless of what style you're working with, you know, whether you're working with like a band's project like this one that was recorded here in Reason or something more electronic, beat based or chill out stuff. And we will be looking at those sort of projects um, in contrast to, to what you're hearing now. Um, but regardless of what style you're working with, it's really best to have some uh, great tips and tricks under your belt to take things to the next stage. And that's what I'm going to be showing you uh, across the next uh, 30 or so uh, tutorials in this course and we're going to be concentrating on all sorts of techniques how to use Reason's effects uh, and routing and console uh, to get the best out of your mixes. I'll also be looking at mastering and you can see here um, in this uh, track we've got plenty of things going on we've got um, plenty of parallel channels group channels anything here with a, a red fader is a group channel and also we've got plenty of MIDI as well. So we've got MIDI instruments and, and samplers and effects, even some pitch correction and mastering processes here as well. So we're gonna be looking at all of this, but before we do that, um, I'm gonna actually show you how to strip back and go back to the stage where you will have just imported uh, your tracks or your audio from a recording, whether you recorded it in Reason or whether you recorded it in another DAW but I'm going to show you essentially how to organize your tracks and how to organize your audio and um, the mixer, the console, to get the best start, really, and ensure that you've got a really quick overview anytime you look at your mixer of exactly what's going on. And you'll thank me for this because we're going to be looking at some pretty advanced uh, mixing techniques with lots of parallel channels and group buses and plenty of different inserts and combinators. And the last thing you want to do is get bogged down in a mix that is a little overcomplicated and unorganized. So that's what we're going to be looking at next, um, organization and workflow. Then we're going to move on to how, how to uh, consolidate uh, and self-contain your project in case you move it to another machine. And then we'll get right into some advanced techniques. 